so is uh, is uh, pipe smoking a habit or a hobby that is the question that I am raising right now woke up a little bit late today so I have to kind of just do my coffee and pipe thing in the car but uh you know I was thinking about like there's definitely I've seen some definite uh, benefits at least in my mind from smoking a pipe and uh, I can tell you mainly it sort of uh, develops some patience and uh, I don't know just like the ability to sit down for a while and kind of just read and stuff and I mean I, I not like I couldn't read before but I just more frequently just just more in the habit of just sort of you know resting in a way but uh that kind of thing because smoking a pipe is really good if you do it in sort of a relaxed effortless way it's very you know tasty and just nice something about it I don't know but uh you know, I still would have to, I would classify it as a habit, not a hobby. I think we kind of kid ourselves that it's a hobby. Because, uh, you know, there's some collecting and this and that. But, uh, I think you can make a hobby out of it. But I think at heart, it, what it really is, is a habit. I don't think it's that dissimilar to smoking cigarettes, honestly. I mean, I think it's it's maybe a deeper level of the same thing. Because I actually think people smoke cigarettes for the same meditative reasons they smoke a pipe or a cigar. I think it, it's a, sort of a sanctioned time of it's your time. It's your little reflection time. Your little, meditation it's just a time away from the rest of uh, the world you know and we all need that some people can only do you know a couple minutes some people can do a little longer I kind of think that's now there's also the nicotine addiction or whatever they you want to call that I don't know I'm addicted to nicotine the way I'm addicted to like a good steak I don't have to have it, but yeah, I'd like to have it. Have a rainy day today. I could not go to sleep last night. I drink, they have this coffee up at, uh, at the school in the cafeteria. It's 30% extra caffeine coffee. Uh, I've been drinking that. I drank a cup of it yesterday during lunch. And, uh, yeah, it was kind of hard to get to sleep last night. I thought it had worn off. Smoking uh, Prince's Blend out of a, uh, what is this, a, uh, I forgot, nah, uh, it's one of those Denmark pipes. kind of argue if it's a healthy habit I don't, I don't know maybe a little bit probably not in some ways 
you know, moderation is key, right? But, uh, yeah, I would call it a habit. Hobby to me is, sounds, uh, well, gay, but, you know, it's like, I picture a hobby is like making, like, model airplanes or something. I don't know. Smoking is not a hobby. That's not a hobby. Sorry. Because at the end of the day, you are smoking, you know. But, despite whatever negatives there are, I have to say, you know, whether one causes the other or they go together, however it is, my pipe smoking, Bible time, coffee time, whatever, you know, this combo I got is like, awesome so I, I highly recommend it even if you don't necessarily even if you're agnostic I, I would just open your Bible up a little bit or find, find a Bible just read a little bit and just uh, I mean don't even try to think about it just enjoy a pipe and, and uh, let your eyes fall on those words and see what happens I honestly believe there's benefit gain from simply staring at the words. Um, now, I am kind of studying the Old Testament, but I would recommend you start in the New Testament. In fact, I would actually recommend that you not even start with the Gospels, but start with uh, Paul's letters, and then kind of work backwards. Anyway, Good habits.